What's going on, Warriors? It's your boy, Lionheart. I'm back. Feels good, man. I'm not wasting time, man. I'm going to talk about my statues. I got like a bunch of godlike items from uh, Comic Con. Um, yeah, man. Comic Con London. Real cool, real interesting. Um, I want to share my statues with you, man. I mean, I can't share everything I got basically in one video. Because I've got way too much stuff for that. But what I thought I'll do is I thought I would do a video talking about the statues, the Marvel statues that I got. Yeah? And then I will do another video where I talk about the anime and manga statues that I got. You can see them in the back, actually. So that's a little bit of a taster. So, yeah. First of all, I want to show you this. Iron Man. This is from Iron Man 3. It's godlike. Yeah, I was just cleaning it actually. So it's still got a little bit of water on it. But yeah, this is the Iron Man suit armor from Iron Man 3. It is the Mark the Mark XL2. And that's the box that it come in, basically. There was no point in me doing an unboxing basically because when I got it I was just too happy and too excited to so, wait, so I just opened it. That was it. So, yeah. Amazing. And I've got it in sentry mode. If you watch Iron Man 3, and then he was like um, in um, sentry mode, and it just went into sentry mode, that's what it is. It's got like different arms. You have different arms, and you can take certain bits of it off, and then some parts of it light up. I don't know if you can see it lighting up. Yeah, you can see that. Uh, it's like parts of the body can light up and stuff in it. I like this one. Oh, I think you can see that actually. So yeah, it's real cool, man. I love that. I love that. Like that is just. That's going in my front room, and that is be that is on sentry duty, sentry mode. That is, that's godlike. I'm sorry, that's too godlike. Yeah, so that's the Iron Man, right? Uh, that was, that is made by NECA Online, right? Uh, like, they, like, of, they make official um, statues for, like, Marvel sometimes, in it? So, yeah, that was the one they made during the Iron Man 3 era. And I always like that armour. That's my favourite Iron Man armour. So yeah, we talked about that one. Now, I want to talk about Spider-Gwen. i got like a Spider-Gwen. This is the uh, Kotobukiya. Yeah. Like, he is a pretty godlike artist. Sorry. It's people that basically do these type of statues. You know, the artist is, it's actually on here actually. I don't know how. I don't think I'll say his name right, but it is um, Sonoya Yamashita. Yeah, he does basically all the artwork for the um, Kotobukiya toys. He does basically all the artwork for the minute. And then when you look at the models, the models are basically literally based off his art, right? So this is an amazing statue. Amazing. So let's look, let's open it. Let's get to it. Right. Like I got them for like some amazing prices, man. Like prices that you will not get online. I'm telling you right now. Okay, so that's her head, that's her head there, okay that's her stand, the stand thing that you put her in, and there she is, 
by the Gwen. I think that's pretty cool, man. Like, you've got her normal face. Okay, so. i right, take this out. Yeah, I'm starting to love off these um, collectibles, isn't it? Like, these collectible statues. I was never really into statues before, but I don't know. Since I've literally, I've become like a homebody, right? Like I have, I feel like I've lost the interest and the value of going out all the time to have a good time, right? Because that's how I was like before, isn't it? I know it sounds pretty shallow, but I just feel, I felt like before I needed to go out all the time to have fun. But now I don't have that inclination. I feel like I can have a very, very, very exceptionally good time just by staying at home. And so when I am at home, I want to surround myself with things that make me happy. That's what I feel like my life is about right now. So I'll just put this in here. I don't want to break it, but there you go. Oh, sick. Look, so yeah, so it's in there like that. That's good, like, man. I don't know if you see a face. I don't know if you see a face, but yeah. Gwen Stacy. Spider Gwen. And then, you know what, yeah? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's let's take a, let's take the head off. Take the head off. Yeah, that is cool, man. That is cool. I'm taking the head off. Is it easy to take off? Okay. I hope that's it. Okay. Okay, I see it. Look, so you have this head there. That's the hoodie thing that you put the hoodie on. You put the hoodie on. And then you put the head on. That's cool. I hope I'm not breaking any tattoo taboos or anything in revealing all of this stuff. Never seen a video that shows that kind of stuff happening, but you know, whatever. <laughs> Let's put the head on you. Let's put the head on you, Stace. Let's give you a head, yeah? Yeah, it looks sick, it looks sick, it looks sick. Gwen Stacy, with the head on. Yeah, that's sick, man. That's that sick life, man. Yeah, I love that. You know what I think I'm going to do? I think I'm going to leave it with that one. I like that. So that's the Kutubukia Gwen Stacy statue. That is awesome, man. I like that. I like that. That's wicked. That's wicked. Gwen, chill out with Iron Man for a bit. Yeah? That's not it. I'm not done. I got some more marble statues. Uh, This is the female dad Deadpool. This is awesome. I've got to show you this one. I'm going, I'm going. Wow. That's so sick. Yes. Yes. You know what, I should I put this away. I don't need it. There you go. <laughs> it's ridiculous. That is so cool. I love it. I think it's the red. I like red in it. 
Okay, stop around her hand. I can't get it off of her hand. Okay, so it's actually... It's put onto her hand a little bit too good. I can't get it off her hand. Okay, I can... I can't get it off her hands. So... God. Oh, did I break it? Did I break it? I've just broken it. Get off me. I've just broken it. Oh my god, I've just... Oh no, I haven't. Okay. Oh no, she's got a spare hand. Oh, okay. Yeah, I haven't broken it. Yay. Oh! Uh... There we go. There we go. That's awesome. Okay, so they've got that tape around the bits that can that are delicate, so to speak. That is amazing. That is just. I love that. Her face is pretty, man. It's actually really, really cool. And the hair. Kind of got like that anime, 70s anime hair. That is so cool, man. Oh yeah, and then... And she's actually on the... Wait a second. She's... They, they've, okay, so she's screwed to the stand. Okay. And the stand is basically, if you can see that, it's basically Deadpool. The Deadpool sign. I don't know if you can see that. So yeah. That is... The Kotobukiya Deadpool statue. That's amazing. That is amazing. One second. Uh, let me <coughs> let me try and take the head off. You know what I want to do? I because she's got what is all this stuff? Oh, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Yo, check this. Is it this hand you'll do it in? It's this hand. Okay, that's why you can take the hands off. Watch this. <laughs> yeah, look. So she's taken the... She's basically taken the mask off. You see it there? That is sick. I got some cool shit from that place, man. And she got like a different head. Oh, she got like bombs. Oh, she got like other little components, like a bomb. Where would I keep put the bomb? Whatever. I think you literally just put it like there or something like that. But she's got like another head. Let me show you the head. That's the head. Let me pull it on her. Let me take the hand off. Oh, I don't know. Okay, it's good. It's put on securely. I like it. And then you can put the head on. And you put the head on. Yeah. But that's not it. It's not over. You can actually put like this the her like the her hair on there. Am I putting on the right way? Okay, I think I am. That is the coolest thing, man. So look, female Deadpool with the mask and the hair. Oh, sorry. Minus the hand. <laughs> My bad. So yeah. That is so good. I do like that. I like them whichever one you put them on actually. No, I think about it. Whatever. That's awesome. Okay, that's the assembly instructions. And so let me just quickly show you. 
like you see that's the bomb that I was talking about that is a bomb right it does look like a bomb yeah see that's the bomb and where would I even put that does that go somewhere that I need to know about? Okay, there's like a little bit of an instruction, so... Then it's got to be instructions with Gwen Stacy. There was no instructions with Gwen Stacy. Did I get an opened one? No, I didn't. I actually know I didn't, I had to rip everything open. Whatever. So, yeah. That's the female Deadpool. The Gwen Stacy. And Iron Man. That's so good. What do you guys think? I think that's fucking pucker, man. Hmm. I'm thinking... Nah. I was going, I'm thinking to do the anime one as well. But no, the video will go on a little bit too long. Okay. Okay. I'm going to do the anime one. But after this one. And that one <coughs> is going to be a review. So I'm basically going to review my statue that I have for um, Dio because I've got Dio um, Rem I'll do the one for Dio and Rem right and then the um, Lost statue for the Seven Deadly Sins that can have its own video so yeah Warriors stay tuned for my next video because I've got some good stuff coming for you next and um, yeah Thanks for watching, thanks for sticking with me. You know, like doing these videos, talking all loads of, all loads of shit. <laughs> Just hanging out with you guys, man. Hanging out, chatting. It is what it is, man. It is what it is. So, um, yeah. Warriors, once again, thank you. And um, catch you soon. Later.